Well, look at this. And you know, we just turned the corner at Cade's Cove from where the, uh, the restroom area is and all that. And you make that first turn. Well, the first right hand turn, I started to notice a graveyard. I'd never seen it before. So this is what it says here. Take a quick picture of that. Oh. So let's see. There's 1856. Trying to Matthew Gate Marth Marthley Gable. KB Cable. Born 18. Died September 1818. Rebecca Cable, 1844 to 1940. Wow, so she lived in, wow, 96? Huh. They must have given her a, a new stone, huh? Born October 1862, died September, and there's a crack right there. Cloden died 1924. Here's one. This one says, um, William N. Lecure, L-E-Q-U-I-R-E, Lecure, Private, North Carolina Confederate Legion, that's his, Riley Cable, Calvin Cable, you know, I'm starting to get the idea this might be about one family, Amanda Wilcox. There's Amanda Wilcox, 1899. Oh, she was only nine years old. I'm so sorry for that. Betty Craig, James Cable, lived from 1849 to 1930. That would put him at 81, huh? Julius Craig, Rebecca Jane, wife of Carson Birchfield, our dear mother. J. Brody Smith. <laughs> Born September 5th, 1881. Died September 26, 1907, looks like. They may have changed their mind during the carving. Uh, age 26 years old, 21 days. Asleep in Jesus. Rod Law, he just got buried here in November 2023. 1952 to November 2023. Now that's a rather new one right there. Look at that. Wonder how he qualified. But that's good. He's in. He's in um, the company of very old people. Huh. I don't know if any of you have ever seen this. So Richard Wilcox, 1912. Harley, 1913. Millie McLennan. Verna McLennan. Emma. Elma. Elm. Elmina. Wilcox. Flossy. <laughs> There's a Flossy. All right. Sarah Maud Schlosselman. 1956, 1974. Very interesting. Who knew all these graves were out here? So this is the Schlosselman Cable uh, Graveyard. Going back to, it looks like 1822 is a 1877, 1849. Interesting, interesting, interesting. 